The University of Calaba has made history by electing its first female student union governing uh, president, uh, Blessing Alims. This marks a significant step towards gender equality and representation in the university leadership. Alims has highlighted her commitment to collaborating closely with the university administration to combat gender-based violence, a pervasive issue affecting students. She says she aims to implement proactive measures towards the creation of a safer, inclusive environment for all students. Meanwhile, the vice chancellor, Professor Florence Obi, has expressed hope that Alim's leadership will bring positive changes and promote a more equitable and supportive campus culture. The process towards success, they say it's hard work. And to attain success, it doesn't come easy. That's simply to say that the process was not an easy ride, but with God on my side, I skill through. The SDG is made up of executives, nine of us, and being the principal head of the schools, I cannot entrust all responsibilities on my hand. So we have delegation of responsibilities. So we have the suggestion boss that would help us to get feedback from students on their well-being and what they think should be improved. I would ensure I work on the already existing rules on fighting against gender-based violence. Then if there are things that should be added that are not there, then I will come in with my executives. The student union government is um, very well structured and um, the student affairs is also uh, here to assist whoever becomes the president of the SUG. Uh, working with all other stakeholders and ESCO members. Uh, she will not be doing it alone. We have um, quite a number of um, able young women and young men too who will be assisting her. So I don't foresee uh, having any challenge. And uh, the way she has been received uh, by the generality of students uh, makes me think that uh, she will get about that very successfully. It's not just about gender we talk about in Unica. We talk about capacity. We talk about ability. If the man can do it, fine, he gets it. The woman can do it, she gets it. Um, she's the fourth SUG president I produced as I came on board. Three, the past three were men. And I didn't bring her up. This is the first time for the four times we have conducted election. This is the very first one that has ended without any petition. She, her, her emergence, brought no position, no position, no discernment. Usually, whenever the president is elected, we have petitions, counter petitions, we'll be holding meetings before inauguration. For this one, she was widely accepted. It shows that she was quite popular, and she worked hard with the people. So I'm happy, but we are watching, and I know everybody's watching to see what um, the first female SUG president, Unica, will do.